Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Serpents. Not Serpents, there's only one Serpent in the Staglands. This is Colonel RPG, as usual, and I'm very happy that he chose to join me today as we go on to draw some runes in some old books. How did I say old books, but they look like demonic books, more like, but I don't know. How, are, are demonic books supposed to be old? Because, I mean, if they're godlike, they have to be like outside time or space or something, I don't know. But anyway, there we got some uh, shock rubbings from, um, what's, what's his name? What's this guy's name? What's this guy's name? Vasil, Vasils, from Vasil, and um, we know the books, we know where to put them, and uh, to put the runes, to draw the runes on. So, I, uh, I guess this, I mean, since I, I think I have already seen every single location in the game, we could be, we could be theoretically reaching the end of the game, and it's been, it's been a pretty good, a pretty good, a uh, pretty good run in my opinion. I, I mean, for a game that's now on, uh, on, it's not on sale, but um, it's available for nineteen ninety nine, and uh, for a game that uh, draws so much from from such, from much loved RPGs, computer RPGs, and uh, in my opinion, stands head and shoulders above much of what has been done in the last few years. Um, of course, not in the graphical department, but I mean, it's been a good run. I'm, I'll have to replay the game once or twice to at least get a, a better grasp about the uh, replayability of the game itself. But uh, Serpent in the Staglands, if it if it uh, if, if it's about to end, and maybe it's not. I'm just conjecturing here. I don't know. I don't know. If it's about to end, then it's been a good run. If not, all the best. Let's check this out. Okay, first let me see the runes. So is this the start? Or is this the end? Is it like this? Hmm. Let's let's do it like this because I think it's easier. So yeah, I move. Yeah, I know about this. Let's just go. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So and oh come on, maybe it's the other way around. No, nope, that's it. The book closes with a sharp twist, as though snatched by an invisible hand in the dark, clotted blood begins seeping out of its pages. Without thinking, you touch it cautiously with... How do you touch something cautiously without thinking? Hmm. With one finger. The blood feels thick and slightly unpleasant. Looking around to see if anyone is interested in your... Is... Uh, anyone is looking in your direction. You catch the remaining drops falling from the book. You can into an empty vial and walk away. So we got, what they got? A vial of thick, murky blood collected from the Book of Runes in the Lu in Lumen Fortin. Okay, that's good. Let's just put this over here as, as not to bother me too much. And I'm gonna drop this because I don't think I need that anymore. Let's check this one. So this one is like an inverted L, sort of. No, that's not an inverted L. It's an L with a fancy little thingamajo thingamadoobie over there. And then a leg downwards. Okay, let's go check it out. The other book, because I think... I mean, I'm pretty sure both books are gonna be one for each rune, right? Is it snowy inside? Anyway, um, let's press the finger, so it's like this, and like this, and like this. No? Come on. I need to... Oh, there you go. There you go! The book closes with a sharp twist as though snatched by an invisible hand. And it's the same, same thing. I catch the remaining drops falling from the book. As the hemorrhage finally ends, you stopper your vial and stow it away in your inventory. Okay, so I got a couple... Ooh, what the hell? What the hell is that? What the he... Oh! It's my portal! Hi! What are you doing? Are you surprised or something? What's that? Are you gonna check out the portal? It's a cool portal. Ooh, I can see stuff inside. Wait a minute. Uh, I don't. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah. Uh, okay. So that is that. Map of the ruins. Nah, I don't need that. I guess. Let me quick save before anything else. And uh, let's go in. I guess. Loading screen. Loading screen. Yeah, there it is. Oh, so we're. Are we in the moon realm? Hi! A tall, silken-haired creature with an impossibly pale complexion and hungry glowing eyes walks towards you. 
with the silent grace of a wolf on the hunt. His face has the ageless glow of a young man, but his deep-set, dark-circled eyes belly centuries of life. Intrigued, uh, Giladel's gonna step forward. He's a bloodless. Oh. So we got nobility and Arbinger with Giladel, and we got linguistics with Minodora. So I hope the bloodless can speak, because otherwise Giladel's gonna have a tough time. Few mortals are quite so eager to gain entry to my hideout. Oh, yeah, he's speaking. Good, good, good. Usually they find themselves eared against their will, but you have the most. Per you are. You have been most persistent. You have your audience. Tell me, what is it you wish of me? Such determination deserves a hearing at least before you become my newest slave. Huh. I don't think that's gonna happen. Uh, but uh, first, I, I. Yeah, I was. I was most eager to speak with you. I know something of the nature of gods and was curious to see one of your kind. Alas, it will be the last thing you will be seeing. You'd think someone with the wits you find with the wits to find my lair would be more interesting, but I can see you are not worthy of my time, nor even intelligent enough to make a decent slave. At least your death will provide me with some sport. Well, I take offense to that. No kidding. Okay, 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 stop that. Okay, Catalina is oh yeah, okay. Mmm. Okay, we're fighting the bloodless. So let's get uh Everyone to wear their favorite swords, and I'm gonna give this to to him because it might as well. And let's focus on one guy only. So, got a bloodless slave. Are these all slaves? Oh, they're not bloodless. They're not bloodless exactly. Are they? Weird. Huh. Okay, so let's go with that and um, let's kill that guy and. Uh, you are gonna heal Catalina, and you are gonna amplify her, and that's how it is. Okay, there's a wolf, a bloodless wolf. That's not gonna go well. Nope, it's not going well at all, because I think I should focus on the wolf first, because the wolf is attacking Minodora. That is gonna be trouble. Nope, Minodora is taking lots of damage. Let's get her out of there as soon as possible. There it is. Okay, the wolf is down. Good. So Minodora can resume her Amplify casting and attack the Bloodless. Hopefully I'll be dealing damage though. Because I don't feel very... Am I dealing... I'm dealing... Oh yeah, I'm killing them! Fantastic! So this is going well! This is going well! That was my... That was a big fear for me. Because I, I didn't know if this was, was gonna go well. What the hell is that? Um... Why, why, why are not my buffs appearing over here as usual? Is that for my debuffs only? I don't know. Uh, so okay, whatever. Um, yeah, we're 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 doing well. I mean, with the last level up, I guess we, and with with uh, what's his name? Vasil, with Vasil's help, um, I guess we're a bit better off. And uh, that's gonna be how I'm gonna proceed with my um, fighting right now. So we're all good. Let's just pick up what we can. Edible arts. Go with that and some emeralds. Good, good, good. By the way, um, edible arts can go right to my. No, what? They can't. They can't. Okay. So let me save. It appears that we're safe in here, but this this is actually a pretty place. What? What is it? Oh, we got a st stairway. Is that a stairway? Passage? Nah. Way out, maybe. Cause it looks like. Is this a church or something? Maybe it is. Looks like something of that sort. Got a library over here. Got a little bit of um, bookshelves, maybe. I don't know, library? I don't know. Whatever. Whatever this is, we are here to kill some bloodless, apparently, because they mean us arm. Unfortunately, because I could, I, I would like to talk with them a little bit, but I don't think that's going to be possible. And these guys are that set on going through there. Okay. There it is, there it is, okay, can you go out, please? No, I mean, I don't mean there, God, you idiots. Okay, is everyone out? Everyone's out, good. So, mushrooms, we got, ooh, old. It is a grim walk, a grim work then in there. I, a bloodless is not a small force. My friends will be pleased. I hope we return to them soon. Uh, when we have time, we'll venture to Istakale. Stay calm until then. I don't know what, what green work was that he was talking about. 
Was that the grim work we did with the bloodless slaves? Because they were not bloodless, they were just slaves. I mean, unless they... Oh, yeah, the bloodless, they, they kind of... Ooh. We've seen this before. We have seen this before in Istakale. No, Lumen Targ. Yeah. That was the only place I've seen that. Not in Istakale, though. There's a towering wall with... Ooh, quite beautiful, actually. I do like this sort of uh, architecture. Um, tall windows and all, I like that sort of stuff. It's one of the reasons I, I love so much the Legacy of Kane saga. It's the architecture was just so beautiful. But this one is a bit otherworldly. Uh, not unlike Nosgoth. Not unlike Nosgoth. If you're a fan of Legacy of Kane, you know what I'm talking about. Otherwise, you don't. But I do recommend that you play the games, the Neg Legacy of Kane games. But anyway, there's an entrance over here. Let's check it out. Because outside doesn't seem to have anything interesting for us. Hmm. Health potions and all that sort of shenanigans. Yeah, I need. I just need to be more careful about um, combat that doesn't auto pause because that combat apparently didn't auto pause. It basically, because we were all, we were already talking in dialogue mode, and uh, as soon as the combat started, that created a small bit of a hiccup. If uh, if I'm correct, and ooh, apparently there's not much here to explore. Let's go down again. Oh, it's like that. Just like that, okay? Okay, fine. I'm fine with that. Totally fine. Got it. Oh, I'm saying oh a lot of times, but I remember we were looking about we were looking for a a raft before, but not here though. And for a completely different reason. But I haven't been here, have I? I don't think I have. No. But why is the map uncovered? Have I been here? I don't remember this. I have been here. Why the? I think I have been here. Why the? What? What is this? I fisherman. Are we? Are we in Corum? Maybe. I have been here. Oh. Okay. So that is that. Okay. That's fine. Apparently, we weren't teleported to um, to the moon at all. We are right now. I think we are somewhere. We definitely are somewhere, but more precisely in a place. That's that's what I'm trying to say. Let me say quick save before I leave. But we'll find out. We'll find out where we are. We are in Ooh. Ruin Council. It's been a while. It's been a while. So we need to go to Istakale. And let me take this route through there. There it is. I'm not sure if we're gonna need to pay. Uh okay, why are you going there? Why would you go there at all? Oh, what, what? Why did I... What's that? North crossing? Why didn't it... Did we see that before? Well, let's check it out, because I guess if we didn't, then... Um, yeah, we didn't. It probably didn't. If we did, oh, whatever. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. We'll, we'll check it out, but it may be a crossing, much like the Orphs Bridge. And uh, just another another excuse for, to make us, to, to force us to... Pay a toll. Okay, so by the way, by the way, let me see. Nah. Okay. I was just messing around with the shortcuts. Shortcut uh, with uh, quick access keys, but no, that, that wasn't it. And what the hell is that? Anthermin Spice. Yeah, they, they want to force us to pay. Uh, hold travelers, no one passes the border without an inspection. Turn over your packs and you'll be on, oh, you will be on your way in a moment. Very well, make it quick. Your inspector might be swifter if we're carrying your papers. Where are do your documents, merchant? Eh, my satchel was full and I tossed them. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, fleshy of medium size and they keep low to the ground. Yeah, what he's talking about. Yeah, whatever. Thank you very well. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't uh, force us to pay a toll, so it's not a big deal. It's not a big. It was talking about the uh, what was the name? I forget. The carrion? No, carrions. I don't. I don't remember. But uh, for some reason, this. This uh, area wasn't shown on the map before. Don't know why. And it's not shown right there. Huh. Interesting. Well, better than Orb's Bridge. That's for sure. Okay, so let's check out with the uh, Bloodless Hunters. Or whatever the name of they, those guys is. And, um, and tell them that we killed a few Bloodless uh, slaves. Yeah. And that they weren't that big of a deal. They really weren't that big of a deal. They were pretty easy to kill, in fact. 
I only needed to take care of Minotaur's health. Got a massive hiccup right there. Uh, excuse me. Uh, but I only needed to take care of uh, Minotaur's health to make sure that she didn't die. But apart from that, it went pretty smoothly. Um, and let me see. Yeah, it's still... We, st we are still pretty far away from level 12 for right now. We'll see how it goes. Um, so, Nicoletta, it's been a while. Hi. Greetings, it's good to see a, co a, company, a companion alive still. Yeah, it's the same thing that you said before. So, did you meet the Bloodless? Did you slay it? It? I s them, you mean them. Yes, <laughs> yeah, but that's 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 too true right there. Yes, yes, and at great cost. My God, dances to hear it, and we are grateful for your help. You've been, uh, you've helped to root out their presence in the Staglands, and it will be many years before they return here. Well, I'm sure the mortals here will be glad to know. We will be glad to only have the content to contend with common monsters then, and the spirits, of course. Although mayhap they will shrink back to see a source of evil destroyed. One may hope, at least. We must be leaving now. There is little for us to do here. Farewell, friend. I wish you farewell. Don't take hi him, though. So, is that it? Is that all there is to this? Huh? Okay. Okay, let me check my journal. Cuz... Um... Uh, this is done, so might as well delete it. Um, uh, I need, I still need to find Octavian though. Or is the cat? So we've been to Fall Die Mare, I think. Or is the cat? Oh right, okay, 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 okay. Okay, we still, we still have a quest. Don't worry, guys. I was just like, what the hell did I get lost in the main quest? But I didn't. I didn't get too lost anyway, but it gets hard to track this thing down. I guess that's one of the reasons why this game is gonna probably excel at being replayable. It's that you forget a bunch of stuff <laughs> and you miss like, a bunch of stuff as well. And by the way, we have this little rune thing over here and none of these runes mean anything to me. They mean absolutely nothing and nobody can, I mean, I probably will get, oh, what's that? Nothing. I uh, probably will get some sort of... Um, some sort of uh, translation device or something in the future, or maybe that doesn't play a role. I don't think it. I th I'm pretty sure it will play a role, but uh, well, f uh, where exactly did I need to go? Um, I think it was Fall Die Mare or Istakale. Uh, so I've been to Fall Thy Mare, but East the Cali, I haven't been there. Yeah, let's go there. Let's check it out. Let's look for Octavian, I guess. Yes, I want to enter. Come on, loading screens. Just get on with it. If you are poisoned, you might cure yourself with a, po a potion or a spell. I prefer spells because they don't they don't cost anything. And besides, do I have antidote potions? I think I do. I think I do. I think I have a couple, but yeah, whatever. Um, not needed right now, I don't think. I hope not, anyway. But uh, is that it? Please load the game. There it is. Okay. So we're looking for... Is this the way into the city? It is. We're looking for Octavian. Wherever is... The... Okay, I'm gonna give you this again. And uh, some bolts. Yeah, you're gonna take those. And uh, you are gonna wear that. Very good. So we're better off in terms of weaponry, I think. And uh, we got nobody here. Nobody to welcome us. Oh, wait wait a minute. I remember this place. This is the place with the huge sort of... Yeah, there it is. Oh, maybe it's Octavian on the other side. Because I don't remember Octavian, anybody being there in actual fact. So nobody will tell me anything. These are just a child... No, whatever, whatever. And so, Harbiter... Um... Are, are you gonna tell me anything? No? Nothing new. Eh, whatever. 
didn't tell me anything new, apparently. Um, unless I missed it while I was skimming the uh, text right there. Let's check out this little place. Hi, shopkeep. No, not interested in, in your wares, although I might be interested in selling some of mine. But I doubt it, though. I have a couple of this. Mm, nothing interesting. Nah, see you later, guy. See you later. I'm gonna speak with the with the counselor. What's it? What's the name of the guy? The the, the boss of town, or whatever. Pavel is the blacksmith's apprentice, I think. Nah, it's just a, a douchebag. Uh, and uh, where exactly was? Okay, I'm a bit lost. Is it over here? It is over here. It is over here. Okay, good, 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 good. I want to speak with the. Oh, there's a path through here. Nice to know. Constable! Hi, Constable! So, that that's not... Yeah, what... Uh, doesn't... Yeah, it's not the Constable that I'm looking for. I'm looking for the Counselor... Counselor... Settler... We got a Squire... And there's somebody in there that I'm gonna check out. Oh, I haven't been here. Oh, I missed this one before I... When I, when I came here last. So that figures... Did I miss it, though? Huh. I think I... I don't know. Why, why would I miss it? Because I'm an idiot? Yeah, I guess, I guess that's a fair enough reason. Although, why is there a loading screen? Hmm, this smells fishy. It smells a bit salty and a bit weird and, and on the moist kind of, kind of side. Don't like smell fish. Nope. Nope, don't like that. Okay, let's send Giladel up ahead. Just make sure that uh, he's ready to speak with anybody. Ooh. Do you remember this? Yep, it's the piano keys that uh, create runes. And for some reason, they are here. Maybe Octavian is here? Maybe he's... What? Is he... That's weird. I mean, it makes sense because his track. Okay, let's go here. Because his... What? What's it? Where the hell am I? Guard? What? No, 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 no. Stay away. I don't mean no harm. Where the hell am I? Am I inside? Oh, I'm... Okay. Okay. I, I, I seem to have... There it is. Okay. So, I think I'm inside. Yeah. This is an inside area. So, I guess I need to kill these dudes. Pretty sure that's how it's gonna be. Hi, dudes. You wanna die? I think you do. You just don't know it, though. You just don't know it. Because it's tough knowing that you want to die. Just, oh. As the guards close in, the prisoner across the wall, the hall reaches his hand out between the bars as if to grab your cloak and cries out wordlessly, wordlessly to you uh, through cracked lips. Help! Okay, so that's, that was a bit weird. But uh, I guess that is, that is what happens when you spend so much time in prison, especially this kind of prison that's not really very conducive to your well-being. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't imagine these guys treating the guards well, the, the prisoners well, but okay, so let's take care of our health for now, because I don't want to die. That's something that I kind of... Okay, that, that guard is dead, so things are going well. Things are going well. So who's being attacked right now? That guard is not dead, though. That guard is injured. So things are not going as well as I thought they were. Oh, no! God damn it! Kill that guy! No, seriously. Kill that thing, and why the hell is... Who the hell... What the hell is... Wor Are you guys casting your spells like I want you to? No? Okay, that guy's dead, good. So, please. People. Do your thing. No, seriously. There it is, okay. So, maybe Catalina wasn't being healed? Or something, I don't know. Did I... Sp nah, whatever. Things are going better right now, I guess. We only have three guards, to, two guards to contend with, so that so that's make makes a little bit of sense. But uh, okay, so that guy, man, these guys are tough. Okay, good. No, I didn't, I didn't want to pick that up. Did I pick that up? I picked that up. No, I want to pick that up. Let's just kill the guard. Is he dead? No, he's not dead. There's just this little arrow right there, doing his chick 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 up and down, up and down. There you go. Come on, kill the thing. I don't. Whatever. Ugh. There it is. Good. Good. Thank you for your assistance and uh, good night, I guess. Since you're dead, it's gonna be black for you from now on, I think. 
Maybe not, though. Maybe it's white. It's going to the light and all that sort of stuff. So, who's working? Okay, everything is as it should be. Let's see. Got a leaf blade plus one. Got a iron pointed shield, which I will take. The ring mail armor is pretty expensive. Let's take a couple of these shields. Let's take the ring mail armor as well, because you never know. And I guess the shields, let's see if they... Nope, that's not what I wanted. There it is. Okay, the shields are not interesting, so I'm just gonna leave them on the ground. And this armor is pretty... Yeah, the, the line... Not... This is bad. This one is bad. But this one, I think, yeah. The ringmail armor is good, but this one... Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll carry it like this. Let's see. So we got a um, long leaf blade, so that's cool. But I think... Yeah, this one is considerably better. Considerably better. So, is that it? No, there's more guards. Okay. Since there are more guards, I'm gonna kill them. Uh, let me just... Ooh, got a... In the distance, you hear a gate creak open. Is that... Was that where the... Did I free... Ooh. Why is it green? Or was... Let's take that. Um, I guess everything is good for now. Okay, so I, did I free the, the prisoners or something? I think I might have. Uh, so let's you cast the usual spells, as usual. And is there any other guard around here? There doesn't seem to be. So that is that. We're taking damage on Catalina, so that's fine as well. That guard is taking some damage, but not a lot, as usual. Because it's all because of his armor. It's probably what it is. Um, so, guard does 11 damage to Catalina. We're dealing a lot of damage to him as well. And there it is. Oh man, one, one, 13, 1300 experience points for killing a guard. Man, that's some real fine amount of experience. Victor? I haven't seen a guy named Victor in this game before, have I? I think I did. I think I'd, I'd remember. Um... Let me check my... Uh, still still a lot, a lot to go for, a, a lot to kill before I, I level up. But I think that's gonna be it for this episode. I'm Colonel RPG and this has been Serpent in the Staglands. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, feel free to leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye!